What is up, fellas? JPS delivers here. This is, well, this is gonna be the final video. Uh, we still have two more franchises to uh, show like an off season of, but I'm just gonna go ahead, just give y'all the news, uh, tell it how, uh, pretty much just let y'all know in the first game of the next season. Um, just I feel like maybe that's just a little overkill. The amount of uh, off season videos, you know, I'm sure a lot of y'all want to watch some fucking football. You know, I feel like uh, we're dealing with an extended um, off season for some of these sports, and it's oddly enough, it feels like an off season for fucking basketball. So there's no point in me trying to throw a bunch of off season videos at y'all. I'm just gonna tell tell you what happens. Pretty much get the gist of how to do it. Hopefully, I've helped anybody else uh, with how they approach, um, uh, with how he or she approaches off season in these Madden games. Um, I mean, they're pretty much all the same. They just, I've shown you all Man 2012. I'm pretty sure that's going to be the one with the most steps on it and stuff like that and shit added into it. So if you can do that, chances are you can fucking do off season for Madden 2005. So I'm just, you know, just for the sake of just continuing on with your franchise, we're going to have just, you know, any explanation for 2005 and then Madden 2008, the user franchise with the Panthers. Just played the Super Bowl the other night. Um, recorded that. We'll edit, chop that up. Um, it was a very good game. Very, very good game. I'm not going to tell you the outcome because uh, how that game went surprised me considering how much we've shat on teams. There you go. Lions end up making it to the Super Bowl against the Steelers. Pretty sure that's the Eli Manning Steelers. And then to look at the results, there you go. 23-16 to 16 Detroit Lions. Again, it's like I said, it's nice to see the 49ers in the Madden 2009 franchise. Uh, the uh, Yeah, that one with the uh, Eagles, Vince Young Eagles, and Kevin Jones. Why don't I fucking hold out? Get the fuck out of here, dude. Injury prone. Guess what, dude? You literally just come in the, this fucking CPU-controlled ass fucking shit with Kevin Jones heading the offseason. You want to have a holdout, dude? He had a pretty impressive season. But guess what, dude? You got Ray Rice and Rashard Mendenhall right behind you for a lot cheaper to deal with. And you want to have a holdout when you also have injury prone? Knowing damn well, making CPU moves in a video game that you should know damn well, injury prone reduces your say in negotiations. You fuck. But I digress. MVP, Ladanian Thompson, he breaks records in this season. He's 99 overall. He's Ladanian Thompson. He's pretty much the most fun running back you could ever play with in any video game. The dude, I mean, the dude had hands pretty much like a wide receiver, better than a, a lot of wide receivers, better than a shit ton of tight ends besides like you know the top like eight tight ends you get um what uh, right there tom brady who was injured that we played his team you get takio spikes one of my more favorite players a linebacker out of auburn right there ah, 13th pick right there didn't even see that played with uh, what, uh the bills and the eagles i think for a decent amount i don't know but braylon edwards he's injured however though the man, I mean, the dude who can leap out of the building, a thousand yard season, right there. Yeah, 95 jumping. Even though it's not Mike Williams, his ability to jump. But still, you have Braylon Edwards and Mike Williams, both these teams, two rookie players in Madden 2006, um, wide receivers who are just complete studs at their colleges, USC for Mike Williams, and then you got. Um, Michigan for Braylon Edwards. Here we go to Marcus Ware, I believe. Did he win? No, 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 no. It did not. It, he did not get Rookie of the Year on that one. I think Braylon Edwards, yeah, Rookie of the Year for offense, offensive Rookie of the Year. Here's retired players heading uh, into here. No, um, no noticeable uh, young career-ending injuries. However, uh, let me fucking spoil it to y'all now, because past this fucking point, fellas. Um, you, you remember a guy who's like maybe the best player on our fucking team named uh, Roy Williams at uh, Strong Safety? Yeah, well, uh, right here, re-sign Antonio Gates. Here we go. Beautiful. Be hey, I mean, hey, just re signed easily the best tight end at this time. Well, him and Tony Gonzalez, top two tight ends. Then looking at other players, maybe some fill-in players. Some players don't need to be signed much there you go Charles Woodson you want Charles Woodson on your team you're gonna re-sign Charles Woodson this Saints team looks pretty pretty fucking stellar like a team that could bounce back maybe improve a little bit in some areas there you go Mr. Polly right there Polly is about to get his cracker he wants his cracker there you go 
we're going to give it to him. Mr. Pauly, well, maybe not just yet. I mean, Chris Hope gets signed right there at free safety. Or maybe, is it? Fuck, who is it? Is it Chris Hope? Who's, but how, however, Roy Williams, Mr. Strong Safety, because we were talking about uh, some of these weird injuries, like Joseph Adai getting an injury after uh, his rookie year, a career-ending injury. We're going to sign Mr. We're going to subine Sebastian Janikowski right there. But guess what, fellas? Unfortunately, I'm going to have to spoil it for some fucking reason. They're going to do uh, the game simulated. And, uh, well, I mean, who fucking plays the preseason games? I don't play the preseason games. Roy Williams. His career is over. In Madden 2006 right here, this is the draft right here. For us, I'm pretty sure we draft a fuck ton of um, outside linebackers. But when looking at it, yeah, heading into the se uh, next season, um, team lo doesn't look bad at all. I mean, team looks really strong. Team looks like really fucking good. Uh, they keep on talking about this team, even though it's my team and the third person. There you go. Shit ton of linebackers right there. You see that? Bunch of young linebackers, but good linebackers. Though. I'll give it to him on that one. But Roy Williams is injured for his career. I think it's really dumb that you see a decent amount, or at least at that frequency, of career-ending injuries. We saw it with, uh, I forgot his first name or something, but it's Tosher. Um, like the lineman for Green Bay, one of the like really, really good tackles at these times in the 2000s uh, with Green Bay. Him and like Chad Clifton, I think. Just an amazing duo at, at uh, tackle for Green Bay Packers. But we saw him, Joseph Adai, in the same one. I forgot which one that was. Maybe Madden 2000. I think it was Madden 2007, actually, yeah. But yeah, Roy Williams. Career's over in this one, fellas. Uh, 98 overall. It's a shame. As always, fellas, take it easy and see y'all next video.